Okay. Well, yes. Yes. Welcome to Pokemon Legends Arceus. The game I was um uh bullied into getting <laughs> from Twitter. So yes, um let's give it a shot. Let's see how it is. I was um at first apprehensive, but you never you never know until you, you try it. Music is so good too. Yeah, I had your stream on in the background when I went to bed. And I was like, this music is actually like really good. It's actually really calming. And I love me a chill game. Uh okay, well, let's begin. Let's begin. With first um selecting Italiano. Espanola. English. Whenever you see now saving on the screen, progress will be automatically saved. You can disable auto save. Ooh. You can disable it. Welcome to my realm, located beyond both time and space. Charmander here? I don't actually know if Charmander's in this game. Maybe not yet. I have one million bits, I will end the stream. Okay. <laughs> it is well thou art here. I am that which humans call Arceus. Now, I wish to know thine appearance. Wait, Arceus is talking to me? Me? What is thy name? I don't know what I should call my character. I usually just name after myself, but... I don't know. My last <laughs> Diamond and Pearl was Almondine. Um, I, I guess I'll just name it after myself. I, don't, I can't think of anything. I'm creatively broke right now because I have a migraine. <laughs> All is correct, as it should be. Is that Jesus? Oh, Jesus, and my suffering. <laughs> I don't mean. Soon thou shalt find thyself in a strange world to thee. A world inhabited by wondrous creatures that humans call Pokemon. I don't mean. Seek out all Pokemon, and thou shalt find me once more. Bye, God. Bye. See you later. Hope you don't abandon me. You know. Wink, wink. Oh, God. Literally. My phone. <laughs> Pokemon sponsored by iPhone Max. Oh no, God confiscated my phone. Oh, that's neat. Oh, that's a neat image. Pokemon Legends. Arceus. Ooh, look at the save lo logo. It's like a temporal rift. Wake up! Ah! Do you wake up, won't you? Oh, hello. Pokemonians. Are you alive, my girl? Oh, ew, it's this dude. Yeah, I'm wearing very modern clothes. Give me quite the shock falling from the sky like that. I fell from the sky? Oh my god, look at the mountain in the background. You guys gonna see your search history? <laughs> no. Thank goodness you seem unharmed. 
Who, where, who are you? I'd like to ask you the same. I mean, you fell out of the sky, you understand. Come now, who in the world does that? I love when they do like the little like tag on the bottom corner of the shirts. That looks so nice. I must say, your clothing is unusual. You wouldn't happen to have an acquaintance in these parts, would you? I doubt it. I don't know. So I'm I'm guessing we we the player character are like Dawn from like actual you know Diamond and Pearl, and we just get transported into the past for some reason. We had to redeem to put me in, coach. Put me in, please. What do you mean? Where's the foot? Can I sniff your big toe? Band. Band. <laughs> no horny. No. I, I don't know. I see. You seem to be in a bit of a pickle. Why do I offer some directions? Do you have somewhere around you could stay? Don't know. So you don't know anyone here, and you don't even know where to spend the night. Well, this is a proper pickle indeed. Are you quite sure you'll be able to survive? Somehow I guess I don't know what to do. I'm just a dog. Why do you have three Pokemon out? Just out. Just hanging out. You've been sent to the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse for inappropriate behavior. In this game, the headphones are a CS phone. That, I mean, that would make sense, because I saw a lot of stuff with, like, having an, a phone, and I was like, why does that, why? That makes no sense to have a phone, but I, but seeing the intro, God literally confiscated your phone to turn it into an Arceus phone, I guess, question mark. So that's why you have a phone? Are you the only character with a phone? I'll be very confused. I see. Well, no gentleman would abandon a person in such need. The main character is from the future. Yeah, I figured. I figured. My my guess is that we're actually just regular Dawn and got transported back. You die in this game? Oh, sweet. I can live out my real life fantasy. Oh my. I've completely forgotten. I just had caught these three runaway Pokemon when you tumbled out of the sky. It's almost as if they knew you would appear here. Coincidence? Ah, oh, but do you even know what a Pokemon is? Of course I do. I don't know anything except Pokemon. <laughs> That's a relief. Though you fell from the sky, it seems you have some common ground, huh? Yes, well, these three Pokemon belong to me. Mysterious creatures that they are. Oh yes, what your name might be. What, your name? What name? <laughs> oh yes, and what might be your name? Oh, oh, so you're called Erebin. That's quite the ring to it. I imagine it must be some lovely meaning. It actually means, um, a brave one in Russian. Fun fact. It's been a long time since I've actually used my name for a character. <laughs> oh, but I do apologize. I haven't even introduced myself. My name is Laventon. I am something of a Pokemon professor. Professor? Professor. That is to say, I'm a scholar seeking to deepen our understanding of Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon such as these are wet. Saying, oh, blast and bother, my darling Pokemon. Why must you run from me again? What in the Pokemon Legends? <laughs> Day on this, what's up? Your real name is Erebin Nani? Yeah. I don't, even, I don't, that's how long it's been since I've used my real name <laughs> online. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry, but do you think you could help me round them up? I beg you. This freaking nerd. You three, wait! Where's Jabron? <gasps> Sorry, I'm still waking up. <laughs> Jabron's at work. I did not have a glass of wine, I promise. Can you jump? Oh no, you can't jump. You can you can do this. Yo, and okay, 10 out of 10 game, you can do this. That's all I need. Kill a Rowlet. Keep banging on him. You can just go to the mountain and jump off. <laughs> Thanks, Will. Thanks, Will. Appreciate the support. Reload Beach. Ooh, of course. I feel like we'll come back here, I'm sure. Oh, for sure. <laughs> I 
I am in charge of the chat. <laughs> yes, basically. Do not jump off the mountain. <laughs> I wasn't going to. I know there's fall damage. Twitter didn't spoil anything um, important, but I know this is basically Monster Hunter <laughs> in Pokemon style. It has the same graphics, too. Question, how good is her stinky leg? Um, it's alright. It's alright, I suppose. Like, 5 out of 10. It's serviceable. Serviceable stink. The only way to get them back is from someone else online? Really? Is this a new Pokemon game? Yes, this is the new one. What's this? Oh, it's my phone! There's a glowing, beeping object over there. God took my phone. You found something that resembles a phone! It's probably your phone, but it's changed shape. You feel a strange power emanating from it. A message appeared on the screen. Oh, I can text God? Yo, I can text God! Can I text God to send me nudes? <laughs> And just bestow upon thee this arc phone and thy mission. Seek out all Pokemon. Gimonion. How is it not damaged? It's a god, so IDK. True effects. I've seen your search history and I don't like it. You're going to hell. <laughs> slow camera, slow camera. I can't even, I can't even pause yet. Yeah, I can recenter my vision. About it. Oh, alas, another miss. Aha! Uh -huh. I'm glad you come to my rescue, my new friend from the sky. I tried catching little runaways by tossing some Pokeballs their way, but not the best at this sort of thing, you see. I'd love to go at it. I'd love to give you a go at it, but perhaps I should tell you a bit about these three first. Oh, that one is Rowlet. Rowlet can photosynthesize like a plant, and apparently it battles using sharp feathers. Ooh. There you go. And over there is Cyndaquil. The fire burning at Cyndaquil's back will flare up whenever it's surprised or irate. Pokemon near the pond is Oshawott. Oshawott naps while floating in the water, and it can battle using a shell-like object on its belly. Shell-like object? It's not a shell? A splash. Oh my, nearly forgot to cover the most crucial thing, how to go about catching Pokemon. Whenever I see his feet, I think he's wearing high heels. <laughs> like, yes, get it. Get it, Leventon. <laughs> Excuse me, I'll be on Twitter. <laughs> No, Arceus, no, it's bad. Here you are, my girl. Pokeballs. Throw these things at Pokemon to catch them. Obtained 50. 50! Oh my god. A mysterious ball that can be thrown at wild Pokemon in order to catch them. These balls can be crafted by hand if you gather the necessary materials. Oh, but I do apologize for that long explanation. Wait, where did I get that from? Ah, uh, but that won't do for an explanation, will it? I do apologize. Let me be more thorough. Now, I've mentioned that already that Pokemon are strange, marvelous creatures. What's so strange about them, you ask? Well, each and every one is able to shrink itself down to a minuscule size. And that's where Pokeballs come in. Pokeballs are a recent invention, you see. Throw one at a Pokemon and... Why, the Pokemon will shrink down to fit inside the ball, comfy as can be. And with that, you've caught a Pokemon. No, we've just met, but I'm afraid I've no one else to turn to. I'll be awfully grateful if you catch my three runaways. Now, the proper technique is to take aim at the Pokemon and then let the ball fly. It's quite simple. So far it may be for me to say so, I suppose, given my own dire lack of skill in this area. <laughs> is that basically crushing their bones? Pokemon don't have bones, they're, they're all made of jello. 
Okay, Pokemon can be caught by throwing Pokeballs at them. Hold down ZR to ready a Pokeball and take aim. You can keep moving around as you do so, so use the right stick to adjust your angle and aim carefully at your target Pokemon. Release the ZR button to throw a Pokeball. If it hits a Pokemon, you might be able to catch it. If you've readied a Pokeball and do not want to throw it, press the B button to cancel the throw. Imagine, like, Laventon is just like, oh my god, this strange person fell from the sky. Oh, never mind, it's a goddamn crackhead. <laughs> just like, Dawn's just like flipping out. Why are they standing up? What do you mean? Who is, who's standing up? Whoops, whoops. Oh, stop, 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 stop throwing them. Okay, you can rapid fire Pokeballs for some reason. Oh, wonderful, you've caught a Pokemon! I think you've quite the knack for this Pokemon catching business, Erwin. Got a useful skill to have around here. Only two of my darling runaways left now. Still, this is most unusual. You don't seem fearful of Pokemon in the slightest. Is that because Pokemon in this world beat the crap out of people? <laughs> Bye. I can hardly believe it, Sarah. Incredible! You know many people fear to even approach Pokemon. Never mind catch them. Bravo, indeed. There's one more to go. Let's wrap this up sharpish, shall we? I have to catch all of them, so... Hello. Bye. Ah, uh, yes. I'm afraid that can happen. Pokeballs are 100% foolproof. Oh, Pokemon, Pokeballs are hardly 100% foolproof. Give it another go, old, old girl. Really old? Oh, I did run away from it, so. What if Jinx died by a Pokemon cannot be me? Could not be me. Thank you very much indeed. Oh, what a relief it is to have them all back. You see, three Pokemon you have caught, only just arrived at their village to help with our research. Yet, they won't listen to anyone. And as I mentioned, they bolted from the village almost as if they knew you'd come falling. But I must say, Urban, I was taken aback by how well you used Pokeballs. How is it that you catch Pokemon so ably when you've only just arrived here? I can't help, but there's a reason you appeared here. Somewhere, some, somewhere, what? One can't help but to think there's a reason you appeared here and now. Don't mind me, I'm just writing my own dialogue. What? Seek out all Pokemon. This object is an arc phone, you say? What an odd device. Could it be guiding you somehow? Why did you just take out your phone and be like, look, Look at this Twitter DM I just got. <laughs> if you'll indulge me for just a moment, there's something I'd like to share with you. You see, I have a dream. To compile this region's first complete record of its Pokémon. We in the field call this catalog such as a Pokédex. Yes, a proper Pokédex is a wonderful work of research, containing de detailed records of all the Pokémon that can be found in a region. But, in order to properly document Pokémon, one must, of course, catch them. And therein lies the rub, I'm afraid. Pokeballs only have just been invented, and not many have mastered the skill of using them. Enter you, a person with clear talent for catching Pokemon. Your goal is to seek out every Pokemon, and mine is to have those Pokemon caught. A ripe situation for teamwork, don't you agree? Come now, what do you say? Shall we help once shall we help one another out, my girl? No. Come now, what do you say? Shall we help one out another, my girl? No. Come now, what do you say? Shall we help one another out, my girl? No. What do you say? Okay, fine. Gun. <laughs> gun. Instead of the phone, she takes out a gun. <laughs> the 
and whoever and wherever you may be, I shall welcome you with open arms. We have Pokedex to complete. We've a Pokedex to complete. Sometimes I miss all the syllables. First things first, let's get these Pokemon back to the village. Then we'll sort out your lodgings and find you some proper clothes and a meal and all that. Follow me then. Onward to Jubilife Village. Jubilife Village! I wonder if we are Dawn from the start of her adventure or the end of her adventure. Like, is she after Pokemon League? Is she before Pokemon League? I am downloading Discord. <laughs> this is like the Gregory thing from Five Nights at Freddy's. Consume posture, consume hydration, consume stretch, consume ad break. You got it, bucko. Plural. Buckos. Plural. Okay. Um, ads are rolling. Ads are rolling. Ads are rolling. Not the ad. Whoops. <laughs> That was an accident. It was Spaghetti that did it. <laughs> he did the... The, um... Quadruple consume. Gregory, Roxy's only fence in her room somewhere. Arceus. Painter, do you see the small vent on the floor? Have you heard about Among Us? It's, it's uh, Freddy again, all over. Freddy and Gregory. I thought I did that, yeah. <laughs> Spaghetti. Spaghetti threw, threw you under the bus. Okay, I was charging my controller, so we should be good now. It only affects non-subs, right? Yeah, 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 you're good, you're good, you're good. Gregory, Roxy's only fence is in her room somewhere. I, uh, you needed to escape. <laughs> Thank you for your tireless work keeping us safe, my good guardsman. This young lady was a great assistance to me and my Pokemon, so I hope I forgive my bringing her into the village for a bit. I've got no toes. I've got no toes! It's just a flat skin sock. Emote only chat, you got a bucko. Is nobody concerned about the perilous mountain in the background? This way, if you please. Jubilee Village. It's come a long way thanks to the fine people of Galaxy Team something something. I understand you might- Ah, oh my god, stop talking so quickly! <laughs> it's time for Astrid to show off all his emotes. Why am I walking so slowly? Why can I not run? This road we're on right now is known to locals as Kanala Avenue. It's the only road. The village was built scarcely two years ago. There's much yet to do and not something something. Since people we know, uh, since we know there's a little local Pokemon. Okay, listen, relax. I can't read that fast. Now that impressive building up ahead is Galaxy Hall headquarters. I will punch you in the goddamn face. Oh, botheration. I've almost forgotten. I need to go and report that we successfully recovered the escaped Pokemon. I need to ask you to wait for me at the canteen. It's just past this bridge here, then to the left. The wallflower is what it's called. Getting a call? Your arc phone is beeping. Somehow it seems to show you where you need to go next. Ooh. Dawn, use the minus button to use the map on your arc phone. You can consult map for guidance to your next, de next destination and information on your missions and requests. 
You'll also see guidance markers when you're out exploring or running around the village. If you're not sure where to go next, stop and look around in all directions to try to spot one of these markers, then head for it. What is that? Actual 147 daddies? What? <laughs> what? I am concerned. Waka. Waka show. Waka show. Waka waka waka. Can I pause yet? Oops, that's a big capture button. Oh, oh my. Unfamiliar land. Ooh. Get another notification. Probably because Twitch is like, hmm, let me just like ignore the streamer. In particular, let me make his stream not work three times in a row and then also not notify people he's going live. <laughs> this game's really quiet for me, so let me raise my volume. Is it loud enough for you guys? I can raise it a little bit more. It's also very choppy. I don't know if you could tell, but it's very choppy. I have a lot of points. Maybe I'll use them all for ad breaks. Let's go. Yes. Gatekeep. Gatekeep the stream. Uh, Floaro Main Street. Hey, nerd. Oh, hello. Look at me like that. I'll kill you. Well, now, aren't you awfully suspicious? The wallflower is for galaxy team folk only. If you have no seats for outsiders, move along. Dang. Rude. Who in the world are you? And what's that bizarre garb you're wearing? Pokemon could slice right through those flimsy excuses for clothes. I doubt your clothes are any thicker than mine. I am the thickest um, lad around here. Lad? Listen. For you to get in here, someone must have vouched for you. Is it Professor Laventon? Do you two know each other? He's from a region a long way off. Not the most reliable sort, though. Letting Pokemon run off and give him the slip and all. Three more of them got away just a while ago. Yeah, and I caught him. I hadn't been resting up after some Pokemon drubbed me with a move called Thundershock. I would have corralled him for sure. But the professor, well... Unfortunately, it's just as Ray says. Oh, it's this is the professor. Unfortunately, it's just as Ray says. I'm a clumsy sort of fellow, to put it mildly. Ah. Everything will be quite alright now. Everybody here has agreed to help us with our Pokédex. As in, she's going to join the Survey Corps? What makes you think that's a good idea? You can't just take in any misfit who wanders out of the wilderness. I'll allow it. <laughs> oh no, she's hot. Assuming the individual can contribute to the Survey Corps, that is. I am the captain of Galaxy Team Survey Corps. You may call me Silene. Rainer, I'm playing Genshin Impact. I'm spending all your Poku dollars for hot women. <laughs> Professor Laventon has told me how you helped secure this Pokemon when they slipped from his control. And now it seems you would like to help us feed... Oh, wait. Uh, now it seems he would like us to feed and house you in exchange for ongoing labor. Hmm. You look to be about 15 or so. Quite old enough to work to your keep. Plus, we can't simply take on any stranger who wanders in among us without any idea of their skills or origins. Tomorrow, we shall see if you can prove yourself worthy. Oh, the most reliable decision, Captain. Now, would you like to join us for a meal? I'm sure we've got plenty of questions for our visitor. That's quite alright. 
I prefer to eat alone, so I made appreciate my meals without distraction. The way she walks, I'm like, God. She literally just said, I am a piece of wood. Ah, uh, aloof as always, I see. Well then, no matter. The rest of us can share a meal and have some pleasant conversation then, huh? Any old chum. The usual potato mochi, if you please. But make it three today. Imagine just yelling at a shop. Wonderful stuff, Benny. Much obliged. Your potato mochi never fails to please. Yeah, get bent, old man. Where'd you find this stranger in the first place, Professor? Oh, well, you know the great hole in the sky. One that people call the space-time rift. Our new friend fell right out of it. That's suspicious. That's weird. Was that a joke? Yes. Come now, I am a scientist. Our job is to observe and explain any and all phenomena. I concern myself with only facts. Now, you already know there are many Pokemon here in the Hisui region. Sure, all over the place. In the grass, in the forests, in the ocean. It's up to us in the Survey Corps. Corps? Survey Corps. To, uh, to study them, figure out what kind of creatures they are. Well, we know this much. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. It's all but impossible to know what kinds of powers they might possess, or what sorts of wondrous things they can do. But that's where everyone will come in. Races with his feet crossed, that's so cute. Hey trainer, can I have more Poké Dollars? I spent, I spent them all on a C6 Deluke. <laughs> trainer, I need more Poké Dollars. I spent them all on a C6 Deluke. She successfully caught three Pokémon, three of them in quick order, you understand. Nobody in Galaxy Team is capable of a feat such as that. This means we can finally begin our Pokémon research in earnest. It's really something. We count ourselves lucky when we manage to catch a single wild Pokémon while fending off their attacks. Ah, <laughs> well, to be perfectly fair, Pokémon that fled to the beach weren't on the attack. But the key to catching Pokemon is getting close enough to aim Pokeball well, and it seems our new friend is fearless enough just to do that. Does the Survey Corps really have the leeway to be enjoying a leisurely meal with this outsider? Your captain just ordered ten whole portions of potato mochi, you know. The slow progress on that Pokedex of yours is clearly on her has her on edge. I'm sure we'll start to rate in the good captain's stress, eating well enough. Now, have your fail, Arabin. And think, you made it to the Galaxy Team. You'll never be able to worry about a meal again. The team provides for all its members' needs, even if the members fall out of the sky. No, 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 no. That was quite delicious, quite delicious indeed. You're awfully relaxed about this. You don't even know uh, what we have to get, Arabin. Wait. You do know we won't get Arabin to this, join the Survey Corps unless she passes a trial. Not to worry, I have complete confidence in Arabin's skills. Let's hope it's not misplaced. Arabin, was it? For tonight at least, we will provide you with a place to sleep. You may use our quarters there. But, if you fail to pass the trial we put to you two tomorrow, you must move on. You will be expelled from the village to meet your fate, perhaps your death in the wilds. Uh, Captain Silene's like Kasui, in a way. They're both plenty harsh. Who oh, now? She simply puts on a stern front up, keep us all safe. At any rate, I think it's time we turned in for the night, huh? It's a good thing we can't fall out of the futons while we sleep here. I imagined our new friend has had enough falling for one day. And with that, I bid you both a good night. Yeah, sleep tight. Still, people falling from the sky? That's some kind of story.
Hey trainer, have you seen Raiden Shogun? I need more Poké Dollars to get a C6. Trainer. <laughs> it reminds me of the Solid Snake voice where he's like, Ugh, Colonel. I'm trying to crawl around these vents, but I'm too dummy thick, and I keep eluding the guards with the clapping of my butt cheeks. Boy, now who might you be? I haven't seen you in the village before. Colonel. The captain of the survey corps, Silene. I wonder if there's anything that actually scares her. Toma. Edith. Oh, speaking of Toma, I wonder if um, the Faye channel will be anytime soon. Oh, you're cute. I like your design. You look like that one Pokemon, the Leopard? Li Liopard? Li Li Leopard? Ooh, this is pretty. Trainer, download Genshin Impact. It is fun. Uh, trainer. I'm trying to observe you from the mountain clouds, but my butt cheeks are too dummy thick. And I keep alerting the Pokemon. Is that garlic? Yo, let's go. That's all I need. Yeah, so this is what I was talking about, Asterisk, about. So, so you're wearing shoes, right? You're wearing shoes, and then you go, and your shoes are off. That's a nice little attention to detail, because in Japanese culture, you must take off your shoes. Ah, yes, low-poly books. Checking survey tips. Survey tips can contain all sorts of useful information to help you carry out your survey work here in the Hisui region. Read them anytime, simply press the up button. Up button? To open the menu and then go to the help screen. <laughs> Trainer, I can finally smell your big toe. Any tips for team members? Do you wish your toils to be forgotten? Diligent record saving will save your from such fate. Saving your progress. To save progress, press the up button to open the menu, scroll through ZR until you reach the save screen. Uh, there's an autosave function you can use to have your progress saved automatically. You can enable and disable it by scrolling to the help screen in the menu by selecting settings. Nod. Finally, I'm in my own house. I can be a crackhead on my own time. <laughs> Ray and Lavender are just watching from the window, me just like running in circles. <laughs> Like, all right, well, I guess, I guess she's just new. Dress are very solid construction where extra sets of clothing can be kept. Interesting. Can I cook? A nice fire in the sunken hearth can keep the entire room heated. Maybe not yet. It's until tomorrow morning? Sure. Oh, you got Yanfei? Nice. How do you like her so far? Oh! Well, RIP that tree. Next day. Hey, you awake? some wild lightning last night, right? Anyway, if you're up, come on out. What if you can end your Pokemon journey right here just by sleeping the entire day away? Change outfit? The full length mirror. Never mind. There's some lovely stones that someone must have found, but they're just plain old stones. If you can actually decorate this, this would be pretty neat. Paper lantern. Uses oil as fuel. They probably have the tickets. What? <laughs> Investigate. The jug used to store drinking water. It's lid on top to keep debris from falling in. Oh, wow. This chest looks like you can store lots and lots of items in it. Interesting. Did you sleep alright? You know, it's not that easy in a strange new land. Better not keep Captain Silene waiting. Let's hurry to headquarters. 
I'm taller than him. <laughs> Yo, we love a short king, though. Yo, can we make Dawn just like a baddie? <laughs> can we just be like strutting our stuff in this village? Is it Waka? Oh, it's Waka and Show again. Hello. Waka Show Show. Waka Waka Show Show. Shion. Shion. Man, you can boil a <laughs> you can boil a can of soup on those mutton chops. Andvin? Okay. Simona. Pachirisu. Pachi! Iki. Starly is that big? Oh my god. That's horrifying. I think it'd peck your eyes out. Ren. Miki. Miki! Hatsune Miki! Still can't pause. <laughs> I can't do anything. Can I be Oshawa? I mean, I haven't even gotten a Pokemon yet. I just had to catch them, that's all. Fancy. Here we are, Galaxy Hall. What'd you think? Ever see a building this grand before? Don't give up, keep those eyes open! Petzel? Yojiro, what? Well, Pokemon, they, they were everywhere, attacking from all sides. I sent out my partner Pokemon, but against the whole pack, outnumbered. This is what happens when you go so far afield. But the medical corps will do you right. You uh, do realize they prepare your trial. Look, if flung out of the village, you could well die out there. Well, you might die even sooner than that if you have to take this trial without a Pokemon to be your partner. Captain Tylene, ma'am, I have brought Erebin. You may enter. Let us get straight to it. I just want to be an otter. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Jinx, there's new outfits for Rosaria, Mona, Amber, and Jean. Yeah, I saw them. They're the censored outfits, basically, which is interesting. Um, personally, I think that they gave them those outfits because they're going to start with them in the Switch version, but that's just my hypothesis. I'm probably wrong. Anyways. If you wish to join the Galaxy Expedition team, you must prove yourself capable by going out into the Obsidian Fieldlands and catching three different species of Pokemon. Bidoof, Starly, and Shinx. Three species right away? But none of us have even managed to do that. Did the strangers not catch three different Pokemon only yesterday? My child should be simple enough for her. If the professor wasn't exaggerating things, that is. The Galaxy team does not have the means to provide for those who only take without giving. If you wish to stay, you must prove beyond any doubt that you'll be an asset to our cause. I will lend you one of the Survey Corps satchels to carry out whatever you need in the field. Sure. That whatever it is you're wearing doesn't suit our satchels in the least. Ray. I'll expect you to step in if anything goes awry. I used to pronounce that Aubrey. <laughs> People were like, why do you pronounce it like that? I was like, okay, fine, let me ask Google. Let me ask Google how you pronounce this word. Activate guide? Okay. Galaxy Team's entry trial. Press the Y button while consulting the map on your ARC phone, and you can check the tasks you have waiting. There are two types, missions and requests. Missions must be completed to progress your adventure, while requests are optional and given by people you meet. Arden, Arabin, come with me a moment. This is giving everybody an ample, ample practice on how to pronounce my name, because everybody pronounces it incorrectly. Now then, jolly good morning to everyone. What did you need, Professor? 
In order to complete our Pokédex and, well, simply survive this unforgiving land, Arabin must absolutely pass this trial. And as a Pokémon professor, I've got just a ticket to help accomplish that. Yay! Ooh. Ooh. Oh Go on, Arabin, pick the Pokémon that strikes your fancy. With a Pokémon partner of your own, you'll be able to fight off while Pokémon outside the village. These little darlings are very dear to me, but it's plain to see that you're rather curious about you. They are rather curious about you. My girl, which Pokémon do you like and want to keep as your very own? Sorry, it's no competition. It's it's no competition at all. You want Oshawott as your first partner? Yes. Where is Charmander? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> With that, one of the Pokemon you caught at Prelude Beach, for me, will be yours to keep. Good show. You've talked Oshawa back inside his Pokeball for you. So take it. It's yours. You received Oshawa. It is me. <laughs> I don't want this Pokemon, I want Charmander. I don't think I've ever used Charmander. <laughs> ever. <laughs> Word of advice, my girl. Play close attention to these Pokeballs that are empty. Which ones contain Pokemon when you're on the field? Look at these two cheer on their pal Oshawott. Maybe they just want to help Arabin with her trial. That could be well. They did go dashing from the village when Arabin fell out of the sky. After all... Or not you two, I'll have you assist with me and my research for now. Ooh. Ooh. By the by, what species has Captain Silene charged you with catching? Well, that's smashing. All three of those species can be found in Obsidian Fieldland. Let me give you some Pokeballs to use on your trial then. You already gave me 50, dude. Funny, I got. Did you think I was gonna use all 50 and the trial? Wait, I kind of want to go back to the trial on the Prelude Beach and use all of them and see what happens. These Pokeballs may be handcrafted, but they work as a treat, as you've already seen. You'll have this trial cleared in no time. Alright, let's be off. I'll show you the way to Obsidian Fieldlands. Meet me at the gate to your left as you leave headquarters. You know. Best he's live. Yeah, it's about time he would be live, I think. I like your Abra. Oh, she put Cyndaquil in the furnace. Rowlet's in the tree. And then there's an aquarium over here for Oshawa, but I have him, so. Spaghetti the Oshawa. <laughs> I don't I don't think I'm gonna be doing um Twitch plays Pokemon. Sorry, whoops. Um, because that that um is that Nurse Joy? Ma'am, hello? Did you, like, forget to put up your other hairpiece? <laughs> you just wearing one up and one down? Okay, asymmetrical. No fun. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Really boring. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's fun. But it's really boring for me to be waiting. To not play my own game. <laughs> The refund I just now noticed I did that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. Got you. Spaghetti redeemed it like a long time ago, anyways. Because I have three Pokemon games going on right now. I have this one, I have Pokemon Pearl, and I have Pokemon Sword and Shield. Or, sorry, Pokemon Shield. And um, if we're going to do Twitch Plays Pokemon, I'd rather it be Pearl, because doing that for all three games is super annoying for me. 
Because that means I can't play the game that I want to play. <laughs> I have to play a game for somebody else. Trainer, you forgot about your taxes. I wonder what a Starly would like. Um, Oran Berries. Can I do anything? Oshawa, Oshawa, ooh. I saw, I saw a Twitter video of someone throwing their Pokeball like really high. And then when it came back down, their Eevee died. <laughs> they just died. Let me see if I can do that real quick. No, okay, he's fine. Hello. Hi. Hey, bud. You're doing great, bud. No. Okay, how do I put you back in your Pokeball? I guess I'll just leave. Bye. Okay, great. <laughs> that must feel so bad. Yo, thanks for the host, Dorito. Thanks for the host, Dorito. Glad you got your um, Twitch account back. Just remember that Ashwat is me and my body. What? <laughs> Are there no um, cow Pokemon in this game? Is Miltank here? Is Taurus here? Is that a Beldum? No, it's just an oddly shaped curio. Oh, hey, Ray. Oh no. Oh no, he's hot. Oh, what a curious getup you have there. Can we tell you're quite the character? I'm Volo of Ginkgo Guild, the go-to choice of for any merchantile needs in Hisui. I've heard talk of you. Fell from the sky, didn't you? Yeah, that's certainly the tale I'd like to hear. Oh, and you have a Pokemon? You have certainly interesting surprises. Full of interesting surprises. Investigating the odd novel is key to any good merchant success. So what do you say? How about you and I see how our Pokemon stand up together in a battle? Sure. I'd like you better and better. What a delightful find. <laughs> Trainer. He's hot. <laughs> also heard you about this trial you're to attempt. Let's have a quick battle to get your blood pumping before you head out. Though I hope you'll know you'll lose if your Pokemon HP reaches zero. Ginkgo guild member Volo ch challenge you to battle. Oh well, Dorito redeemed ad break. <laughs> and consume stretch. You. Out of Poco. RIP. <laughs> RIP, you don't get to watch this battle. Bye! <laughs> Enjoy ads. <laughs>